Hello. Today I'm going to share with you uh, one of the problems I had with my Mercedes W220 S class. <coughs> it is uh, extremely problem, extreme problem for me because it's, as you see, you turn on the radio. And there is no sound. Here it works. I try to increase the sound level, but it doesn't react. So I spent uh, quite a lot of time uh, on the internet to find out what, what could cause that. And later I found that in this compartment where CD changer and amplifier lives, there were uh, lots of water and I removed those plugs, it was plugs there and there and drained all the water uh, but then I found that a CD changer is basically shot it was submerged in the water and now, now we can see that basically it's all rusted away so connection is very poor and it does not engage. <coughs> so uh, I have read a uh, couple of solutions about it and uh, most people suggest to buy a, a loop to connect this uh, optical cable and here comes, comes the loop and it's, it closes the circuit and then it works again. But uh, I was thinking maybe there is a easier way to do that and I found it. So here is the loop and here is the connection in the amplifier. So I just unplug it and what uh, all I have to do is uh, to connect these two together. This one and this one. And the way I do it is quite simple. You see, here, where is my camera? Okay, here is the uh, the part that keeps the wires inside. So you just take a small screwdriver and remove it gently, trying not to lose it, because it will be necessary. And then the wires comes out. I take the other one which was meant to be connected to CD changer and I will do exactly the same. Yep, this one goes there. Then I have one wire which is not needed for me anymore so one one complete wire I can just throw it away and I have two wires here and again I take connector and put those into places and it's very easy to do because uh, they have slots so you it's not possible to to mix them and put them in the wrong place so So red goes here and white goes here and then I fix it with this small part. Here we go. And then what I do is I simply put it into CD changer. Here is the changer, here is the plug, and popped. And of course I leave this, this wire unused, so I will tape it later on. Let's see what happens next. So I'm back in my car, turning on the radio. Oh, 
Kiss when we dance on the light of floor On the light of floor But I hear sounds in my mind Works like a charm. Of course, I will not be able to use my CD changer anymore, but I don't need it. And if I if I need it, I can buy a replacement any day and connect uh, it back because I have not ruined anything for for life. So, so that was the easy fix for me, and I hope that that's helpful for you as well. Good luck and take care.